Absolutely, Jiu-Jitsu is just like life. One day you go and everything is wonderful. You train really well, you feel great. The next day you go and then things don't work the way you want. You know, maybe somebody pass your guard, give you a hard time, mount, submit you. And that, you know, you learn that these up and downs, especially when you start as a kid, is very important. You learn to win and you learn that losing is not so bad. It's just part of the, the process. In life is the same thing. We get a nice job, everything is going wonderful, and then all of a sudden, your boss don't need you anymore. He fire you. So you have bills to pay, you have children in school, but you have to reinvent yourself. What are you gonna do? You're gonna go home and cry to numb your, your feelings, or you're gonna go out and fight and do whatever you need to do to take care of your family. And that's the same thing in Jiu-Jitsu. So you don't need, that's what I tell my students. When you lose, I mean, don't curse, don't be upset, don't be like making a scene over here. So just, you know, suck it up and try to do better. Think about what you did wrong. Try to, next time you have that on your mind and try to get better and life goes on. It's not the end of the world for you to lose. Even if the guys that like to compete, okay, you lost one tournament. You lost maybe, and you get so frustrated that you don't want to compete anymore. No, the best warrior is the warrior that is always ready for the next battle. It's not the warrior that is going to be crying because he lost one battle. It's the warrior, okay, I lost it today, but tomorrow I'm going to win. And that's the mentality that you transfer for your outside world. <laughs>